Hi everyone, my name is Abel Greg Kantuma. Uh, on this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can actually. Um, I will be explaining a predecessor and a successor uh, in our MS project. Okay, um, let's jump right into it. Okay. So uh, we are going to be assigning some tags right now. Uh, let me give this a name. Okay. Let's say this is site clearance. Okay. Uh, the duration. Let's see. It takes. Let's say in one day. Uh, let's check this it's actually on manually schedule so uh, let's leave it as it is okay um, let's come down here trench excavation okay um, this will take let's say two days let's assign a start this for this uh, let's assign a start day for this okay let's come here blinding let's say this will take two days Okay. Form work. Mm. One day is enough. Okay, good. Now, if, if you look at this from uh, the right hand side of this, you can see we have our chart here. Okay, you can see that um, from the day here, if you look at the start day, uh, we are starting on the third of uh, this is March 25th, 2001. Okay, uh, that means uh, we are starting all of this in one day. Okay, that is just actually what this means from here. Uh, we are actually going to be um, adjusting some of this. In order for you to understand uh, what a predecessor and a successor is okay um, you can see uh, to each of these there is a number this is for site clearance is number one uh, trench excavation number two blinding three form work uh, four okay now uh, look at our predecessor here for example let's say that um, Okay. Let's see uh, our blinding. Uh, sorry, trench excavation. Site clearance is actually going to be uh, a predecessor for trench excavation. So what we'll do here, we can type uh, one. Now, uh, by typing one. Uh, I'm actually telling this that um, my my site clearance immediately after my site clearance uh, I'm going to be starting uh, my trench excavation uh, if you look at this from this side you can see from our chart you can see that uh, our predecessor has actually uh, this for trench excavation it has actually shifted okay and then uh, I'm going to be explaining something here uh, let me double click on trench once I double click uh, you can see from here uh, I have stated that uh, coming down if you come here you can see we have general we have predecessor we have resource we have advanced so we are focusing on predecessor and successor today uh, you can see on my predecessor uh, I'm telling that uh, this uh, for number two my site clearance is actually my predecessor to my trench excavation okay 
okay so what that actually means is that uh, you can see under my predecessor I have finished to start if I click here there is a drop down I have finished to start I have start to start I have finished to finish I have start to finish and then I have none now uh, the finish to start means uh, my site clearance is actually going to finish 100% uh, before I come to my trench excavation okay so uh, right now let me just play with this in order for you to see uh, some of these things I'm trying to explain uh, now finish to start you can see that uh, my site clearance will actually finish completely uh, before my trench excavation is actually going to begin now that is actually what I'm stating here okay now let's look at this from the date you can see uh, Thursday is actually our start date we started on Thursday of uh, uh, of March month of March on the 25th of March okay now you can see uh, my trench excavation is starting on the 26th of March okay so you can see uh, the difference so you see this has actually shifted uh, because I have uh, stated this that uh, this uh, site clearance should finish first before my trend excavation will actually begin if I double click on this uh, let's say I switch this to uh, start to start okay uh, and then I click on ok you can see that uh, this uh, trench excavation has actually shifted okay to uh, 25th of uh, March okay uh, what that means is that my site clearance and my trench excavation is actually starting on a very on the same day okay uh, so you can see there is a shortcut here if I type in 1SS okay uh, I'm telling uh, this that um, this should be start to start okay uh, it's actually starting on a on the on the same day but uh, this trench excavation is actually taking two days to complete okay so my trench excavation i stated that it's actually going to take me two days to finish my trench excavation for example uh maybe uh the soil there is actually or the ground there is actually a bit hard so uh maybe it will take me two days to finish uh that uh, excavation okay so uh i'm going to switch this back to um let's see finish to finish and then uh, let's see what will happen here and then I click on OK now you can see that uh, my trench excavation has actually uh, shifted backward now uh, now instead of uh, this starting on a Thursday you can see this is actually starting on a Wednesday before you come to Thursday what I'm actually stating here is that my trench excavation is starting before my site clearance which is very wrong okay uh, but I'm just trying to demonstrate something to us in order for us to understand uh, the difference between uh, this uh, predecessors okay uh, we have up to uh, four different types here we have start finish to start we have start to start we have finish to finish and then we have start to finish okay uh, so finish to finish what that means is actually that uh, this uh, site clearance and trench excavation I actually want this boot job to be finished on the same day okay but since I have stated that my trench excavation is actually going to take me two days uh, and then my site clearance is actually going to take me one day that means my trench excavation will have to start before my site clearance okay I'm just trying to I'm just stating an example okay Please do not perspire me for this. I'm just, I'm just explaining something right now. Okay, uh, let's play with this. I uh, double click on this and then uh, I take this to start to finish. Okay. So uh, what this means is that uh, you can see this has actually uh, shifted again. So um, my predecessor. Okay. Now uh, my trench excavation, that very day uh, that my trench excavation is actually going to finish my, that day we are finishing our trench excavation is actually the day we are actually going to be starting our site clearance, okay, that is just what this actually means, okay, so uh, my trench, uh, the day I'm starting my site clearance is the day I'm actually uh, rounding up uh, my trench excavation, okay, there are cases whereby you may have a uh, 
multiple sites okay uh, or the project is actually large whereby you're doing uh, some building projects there and then you have some other road networks too as well okay so uh, it could be that the very day you are doing some excavations on uh, those building projects is the day you are doing a site clearance for your road projects okay I'm just trying to explain something here I hope you understand uh, my points right now now you can see that uh, this uh, trench excavation has actually uh, shifted to the, the day that uh, my site clearance is actually stating now if I double click on it again and then uh, let's say I switch this to uh, start uh, to finish okay what did I do I think I just did start to finish okay I just finish to finish oh, I think I have explained everything okay so all these have been well explained okay uh, so that this I'm gonna switch this back to uh, start finish to start okay that means I'm going to finish my site clearance before I start my trench excavation okay but now you can see uh, the blinding here that we have we have a blinding okay um, sometimes while you are still uh, in the process of uh, excavation maybe it's actually a very large site and you have a whole lot of uh, workers working on that site okay uh, you might even start your blinding that very day you are doing your excavation okay uh, so uh, this if I double click on this uh, and then uh, I can make um, my excavation my trench excavation my predecessor okay so my trench excavation is actually uh, number two as you can see and then uh, the type okay invalid tax name okay sorry my trench excavation okay so um here finish to start or sorry start to start okay so the very day i'm doing my excavation is the very day i'm starting my blinding okay but then um okay okay the very day i'm starting my trench excavation is the very day i'm actually starting uh my blinding blinding so uh that is just what i'm trying to explain from this okay and then uh, let's go to our form work if i double click on my form work uh, and then uh, my predecessor it's uh let's say blinding and then uh, yes finish to start so I stated that my form work is actually going to take me a day okay so uh, I'm finishing my form work in one day and if, uh, immediately while immediately when I finish my blinding is when I'm actually going to start uh, my form work okay uh, I hope you understand uh, uh, what we are what I'm actually trying to explain while uh, lastly before uh, we round up uh, this uh, you can see from here we have uh, uh, okay we have site clearance uh, if I if I double click on uh, this my lag you can see here I have uh, for my lag is actually uh, zero day I can add a lag to this uh, let's see I add a lag a lag to this okay let me make this two and then I click on OK now you can see that uh, this has actually shifted a little now uh, what this means is that uh, um, once I finish uh, my blinding and excavation I'm actually not going to be starting uh, my form work immediately 
okay i'm going to be starting my form work after two days okay now you can see uh what what is here you can see uh number three which is this this is three which is the first thing we see here three fs is good is actually uh finish to start okay so uh as i'm finishing uh my blinding i'm starting but i'm not starting immediately i'm starting in two days okay this is actually what this formula means okay so if i if i try to copy this formula for example or i just If I copy this or you can actually decide to type it okay if I copy this uh, and then uh, let's say I place it here I take off this one and then I paste and then I go off okay this is actually already linked to okay let me make this for one now you can see there is actually a shift okay there is a shift here that means uh my trench excavation is actually not going to be starting uh that very deep i want you to actually look at this you can see finish to start now site clearance is actually going to finish before i start my trench excavation but then i'm not starting my trench excavation until after two days okay uh th that is just actually what uh, this actually means okay so i'm not uh, starting until after two days okay so you can see it here from uh, our charts okay you can see that there was a shift okay so if you love what you're seeing make sure that you actually like this video uh give it a thumbs up subscribe to this channel it's actually free click on the bell icon so as to get a notification whenever i post videos i post videos like this on a weekly sometimes on a daily so as to encourage as many that actually want to have a deeper insight of design make sure you stay safe okay